All right, so we got Astrobot speed run and special bots add on, basically like a free update for Astrobots. Grab to it. Let's get right to the video. I almost said Astro World at first. I can't lie to you. <sighs> oh man, this game definitely took a lot of people by surprise. Oh wait, is that the Hell Divers thing? Hold on. So we, we might have uh, more PlayStation games joining the Astrobot like uh, updates and stuff like that. They can they can real like do this for like years. They can like, like legit this for years. Speed run levels. I didn't even know like that, that this game had speed runs. Oh, it's kind of like reminds me of like Fall Guys a little bit. I know, like, not every, like, speedrun, like, type of game like this is, like, Fall Guys or whatever, but, like, I don't know. Ten new boss rescue. Okay. <laughs> Yo. Okay, so we get, we got the Helldiver uh, skin in here, obviously. Is that the Stellar Blade? Yo, they got the Stellar Blade in Hell. <laughs> What is it? <laughs> All right, so basically we have like a new add-on. Uh, I'm gonna call it an update because, bro, we got like new levels, we got new skins, stuff like that. So if you guys actually don't know, um, bro, Astrobot literally came out I think about a few weeks ago, and um, I, I don't want to say that the game was like it was supposed to be like a like a sleeper or nothing like that. But if I'm being honest with you, I wasn't expecting a lot of people to even like play the game. Uh, and again, not because it was a sleeper or whatever. It was just because of like, if you guys don't know. Astrobot technically already been out for like years technically because like whenever you pick up the PS5 uh, Astrobot was like the it was like the default game on the game already so we thought it was always we, we always thought it was like some type of like um, little game that gets you used to like the uh, to like the PS5 like controllers or whatever turns out you know it, like it's an actual game that has like multiple levels and obviously it uses like PlayStation um, icons such as Kratos so Kratos was in there you had um who else did you have in there oh my goodness who else did you have who else did you have you had kratos you had uh 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 um bro my brain is stuck right now i'm sorry y'all this is the first video of the day but um i i really i deeply remember uh like the kratos level kratos mission now listen i am a big kratos fan so maybe i'm like showing like a little bit of bias right now but um uh, they had like a lot of playstation legends coming through um you know in the game and um a lot of the skins that you do have you know uh, like I said, it comes from like a lot of these PlayStation Legends stuff like that. <laughs> I had to clear my throat. But um, now, obviously, we got uh, Hell Divers two, um, you know, skin, and then we got the Stellar Blade. I didn't even know that Stellar Blade was coming. <laughs> I didn't even know Stellar Blade was actually coming through for this. Also, I literally just got word that um, the Stellar Blade was actually coming to the PS Five Pro, which is absolutely huge. But at the same time, as expected, because a lot of these recent um, PlayStation games that just came out. Are definitely going to the uh, PS5 Pro, so uh, really happy about that. And speaking of God of War, I'm surprised you know they haven't showed God of War yet for the PS5 Pro. Um, I think it 1,000% belongs on the PS5 Pro, bro. It's God of War, especially the Ragnarok, like bro, God of War Ragnarok, bro. Oh man, that's bro. Listen, you can see the uh, you can see the Kratos versus Thor fight literally, and like the PS4, uh, I said PS4. Oh my God, <laughs> PS5 Pro graphics. Um, with the ultimate frame rate because obviously if you guys don't know ps5 pro uh, you, It's not even a thing like it, it's not like you have to choose between performance and graphics anymore You can have both whenever like whenever it comes to ps5 pro because before um, If you actually guys don't know um, If you did play God of War or Ragnarok you had the option to choose either like more performance or you choose um, more of like the like graphic side and um, obviously most people went with the performance because you know you want a game to you know to perform well um, rather than you know it look all that good even though it still look good if you put it on performance mode um, But at the same time, you know uh, with the ps5 pro there's no listen. There's like no choice anymore everything is top-notch um, And I know I sound like a I, I listen. I know I sound like a salesman for the ps5 pro um, Yes, yeah, $700 is outrageous, uh, but at the end of the day, I, I can see why um, you know, it's seven hundred dollars. It's basically like a mini PC inside of a PlayStation. So, if I'm being honest with you, that does, that listen, that does not sound bad. A lot of y'all, listen, I don't want to hear nothing, bro. Y'all be spending seven hundred dollars and eight hundred dollars on the new Jordans and, and, and the new Jordans and the new Horatis and Nikes. Y'all, no, don't 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 try to. Oh, well, seven hundred dollars—that's too much. 
for a lot of people, it is too much. But at the end of the day, though, don't act like you haven't spent like a lot of money on something that you've used once or twice and just got rid of. Okay, don't do that. But other than that, man, comment down below, man. What do you guys think about this free update? Um, I, I do like how <laughs> I do actually like these two skins right here um, on the Astro Bot. <laughs> Oh, the Astro Bot. So comment down below, man. What do you guys think about, um, you know, this free update? Yeah, it's a free update. Yeah, free 99. You heard right. Uh, this free update for Astro Bot. See you guys later. Peace out. And.